click the bell icon to turn on notifications. In this module, we'll look at adjusting color for skin tone. Under the Enhance menu, you'll find a section called Adjust Color. When you hover over this, you can see all of these options here. These are the color adjustment options. In this video, we'll specifically look at adjusting color for skin tone. One very important thing I want to mention is that since there is a wide range of skin tones that exist, there's no one-size-fits-all solution and you'll want to take care with each specific case. That's why for this example I'll show you two different images to perform this edit on and show you what the possibilities are. This is another case where you may want to save a copy of your original image in a version set or even just a copy of your first layer in case you ever need to go back. So I've pulled up the Adjust Color for Skin Tone dialog. Make sure that you have the Preview box checked so that you can see in real time what your adjustments will do. You can move these sliders to adjust the tan and the blush, which introduces some pink. And you can also change the ambient light temperature. To use this tool, first click on your subject's face, and then you can adjust the sliders. I've gone really extreme with these sliders just to show you what it does. Here's what happens if you take the blush all the way down and all the way up. And here's what happens when you change the ambient light temperature extremely. So my point with this is, it's always a good idea to perform subtle edits rather than go overboard, especially with portraits. For this one, I might want to make it a little bit warmer, add a little bit of a tan and a little bit of blush. And that's about where I would stop that. Now I'll show you this on a different skin tone. You may recognize this picture from chapter nine. I'll go to enhance, adjust color, adjust color for skin tone. Click on the person. And you can see what happens when you move these sliders. If you want to reset all of these sliders to how they originally were, just click the reset button. And once you're happy with the changes, click OK to commit them. That wraps up this video about adjusting color for skin tone. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full course that this video came from, click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.